PDP stakeholders across Adamawa converged at the government house banquet hall Yola to discuss issue bordering on the party. The meeting sent out on the forthcoming local government elections and its guidelines. To that end, the state PDP chairman, Barista Tahir Shehu, said the party, as always, is ever ready to face the polls and shall abide by the timetable made available by ATSEC. Election is local and elections start at the world level and this is a local government election. It will, all elections will commence from the world and we have local government election very soon. That is why we feel this meeting is very, very, very significant and important for us to call all those that matters, all our critical stakeholders to come. We unveil our timetable, we unveil the timetable of SIEC and we discuss rob mine and see how best we can conduct this election free of any rancor. He revealed that the party has earmarked March 9th as date for the resignation of any office holder who intends to contest. While pleading with stakeholders to play politics within the law and not overheat the process, the party chairman reminded all PDP supporters of the need to work tirelessly for the success of the party. By our timetable in the party, Sales of nomination forms will commence on the first day of February and it will last on 7 February. Submission of completed forms will be done from 8 to 10 February 2022. Screening of aspirants will commence on 12 to 13 February. As I earlier said, some activities in our timetable, we slated it for just a day. And there is no way we can exceed without violating the law. That is why you can see that our screening will commence on 12 and end on 13. Display of screen aspirants will be done on 14 February 2022. Hearing of appeals if any, from the aggrieved aspirants who have been screened out will be had on the 14th February. Uh, on the 15th February, sorry. Counselorship primaries will be conducted on 16th February 2022. And chairmanship primaries will be done on the 18th February 2022. This is our time table. Barista Shehu reinstated the need for all supporters to avail themselves for INEC registration without which they cannot exercise their franchise, stressing that the PDP remains the only way out for Nigeria. The state PDP organizing secretary, Alhaji Hamza Madagali, says women will be given chairmanship nomination form free of charge, while persons living with disabilities will also be given special consideration. PDP is always encouraging women to, uh, to participate in all elections. That's why in our party, uh, we, we make sure that we put it in, in our constitution to make sure that women's, all forms for women are free. And for disabled, we are used to we give them 50% discount always for disabled people living with disability. If they are wishing to contest, their own form are 50% discounted. But for women, are free. Only administrative charges are, they are responsible to pay. But all the issue of form are free for women. Contributing deputy governor. Chief Crowder said, appealed for more brotherliness as the party worked towards ensuring the success of the party in all elections. The party, going by its constitution, is set to adopt either consensus or indirect primaries across the state.